Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Coach Undress with CoachingWithUndress.com, and today we're going to talk about a very, very common situation. There's a term behind it, and I've done a lot of research on it. I couldn't believe actually it exists, but it does happen often. What or have you ever been catfished? Catfished. You hear me? Catfished. We all know what that is when someone has a fake image, a fake identity on a dating app or social media, and they build a relationship off that fake image, and it's not even them. It's someone completely different. It's, a, it's, it's just the most shady behavior I've ever seen in my life. Uh, luckily, I've never been catfished like that. But now, this is interesting, now with all the filters going on on all these cool, fun platforms, and there's one viral one going on on TikTok where like it changes every girl or every person into like a Kardashian doll. And it's it's quite extreme, extremely different on how you look like. I'm sure you could look like that with a lot of makeup and maybe some plastic surgery a little bit, but it's just, it intensifies everything to a point where everyone looks like a uh, a perfect doll. And it's so fake and they are beautiful, don't get me wrong. But that's not necessarily catfished, right? Because it is that person. It's a basically filtered up version of their appearance. You know what that's called? <laughs> <laughs> it's a perfect, interesting, innocent word. Kitten fishing. You heard me. Kitten fishing. Like little kitten, little meow fishing. It's the sister of catfishing. And it's happened more often than actually catfishing these days because people have picked up on catfishers to basically verify the identity. Do a video call before you meet up, which is great and safe and smart. But the kitten fishing, even if you do a video call, you can still have those filters up. And that, again, is, is it's, it's tweaking small details about yourself or changing big details about yourself with these filters. And again, it can mislead to a lot of other shady behavior. A lot of coyote uglies, I could tell you that much. But... I've heard a lot of scenarios, especially when I coach women, how they, you know, especially when they take pictures or post pictures, they have to be about the filters, grab the filters. And I get it. You want to look fresh. Don't get me wrong. I love it, you know. But if it becomes too extremely different than how you look in the everyday situation, maybe not when you wake up in the morning, but if it changes everything about who you are, you are misrepresenting who you are. And you might seem some, see some disappointed faces or discouraged people saying, what's going on here? And I'm sure maybe men do that in some other form. I'm sure they do. Um, but that's just an interesting word that I think we've all come across and been frustrated with a kitten fisher. And I'm just letting you know right now, that word, it's just the beginning with that. I'll tell you that. Catfishing, I think, is pretty much done with because people are now, again, taking the precautions to avoid that. But kitten fishing, and that's a very interesting situation. I want you to leave a comment if you've ever been in this position or if you are doing this to someone else and you're not really, and you're wondering if it's okay. And it's all right. I just want you to share about this. I want you to you know share your story about the situation. If you know someone who has been through this or who's doing it and not feeling bad about it at all, I want you to tag them on this video because, again, it's not necessarily like you're trying to hurt the person by showing a fake version of your face or a filtered version of your face. It's just, again, it's misleading who you really are, and it might just get you to unhealthy relationships. So as much as you want to look great or filtered out, that behavior might show up in the relationship and might be unhealthy in some form. And that's why I want to make sure you're aware of this. So again, it's not the end of the world if you do this or if you, you know, know someone who has, but again, it's just going to add more confusion, discouragement and disappointment down the road. So again, be who you are, ladies. Use your normal ways of looking good and easy up on the filters. I'm sure men do it as well, but just be aware of those kitten fishers. My name is Coach Undress with coachingwithundress.com. Tag this video if you know someone who's been there or leave a comment. I want to hear your story. And of course, as always, subscribe. I always appreciate your subscription. So thank you very much and a nice like as well. Take care.